Hey lovies, how you doing? I'm just setting you guys up. Okay. Happy Sunday, welcome to my channel. Um, in my last video, I bought the Dark and Lovely or Natural. What is this? Koi Moisturizer Souffle, the recipe for all day elongation. Okay, I'm going to do a quick review on this, right? Alright, first let's start with the smell. Smells good to me. Um, the smell is pretty strong, so if you have a sensitive, sensitive nose, you may not like it. But, um, I like the smell. I like the smell, period. Um, the consistency is like... Like, like a whip, wet whip something. It's kind of, it's thick but not, it's thick but wet. I don't know what to compare this to. Um, but when I did my hair in sections, I used, used this much on a section. So remember that. That's the amount that I use. Let me get this off of my hand. But anyway, it's like a, it's kind of like it gives the leave-in conditioner type of feel to it or whatever. But it's it's very very wet. Oh, and it smells so good. Let me wash my hands. Um. So what I did. I co washed my hand with the Garnier Fruities. So as I got out of the my hair section, did four sections, of course. Co washed my hair. And as I got out of the shower, you know, all right, you got your hair separated. This is a section. I split it in half. Put some, what is it, direct leave in. Castor oil to seal it. And then I applied. The all natural, dark and natural, dark and natural, dark and lovely, all natural uh, souffle. And it was, oh, that's what my hair. Um, it was pretty, it went on kind of smooth. I was able to rake it through my hair very easily because my hair was still, it was dripping wet. So once I put that on, I was able to rake it through real easy. Um, but, you know, what I can say about it so far, this is the only the first review. I'm going to have to do it again to give it a fair review. Um, if I put it on my hair, usually it takes 20 minutes for me to diffuse my hair. I diffuse my hair. My hair was still wet. Um, I did my hair at 7 o'clock last night. I went, left the house like around 11 to go out. I came back in the house, it was about like 4.30, almost 5 o'clock. My hair was still kind of damp. Um, I don't know if it was sweat from dancing, but my hair was still wet. And, you know, I can still feel the dampness right here, so it can't be from me dancing. Um, still right here, it's damp. You know, it's still damp, and this is, it's like what? One thirty, one thirty in the afternoon now, so that's weird. Um, so the look at my hair now, it looks like a wash and go that I had in my hair for like five days. Oh, another thing I need to bring up to y'all: um, be careful when mixing. Um, as you guys can see. My crown area has little to no curl definition. You know, you see a few coils up in there. But this area has a mind of its own. It's, it's going to do what it wants to do. So, last night it was acting up, so I decided to see if I can put some of uh, Eagle Style Gel, like, just on, like, the top part, just to, you know, make the curls pop. No, that did not work. Um... I had the white ball syndrome in my head going on. Like, I put some over in this area. That's why I have this area pinned back because I had to smooth it through, wet my hair again, and squeeze that crap out of my hair. So, I just pinned it back. Um, 
yeah, the white hair, hair balls, you know, wherever I put the gel at, so please be careful with the gel and this product. I will try it again to see, but I will try it in like a smaller area to see. Um, I'll do a quick turnaround for you guys, but this looks like a wash and go that I have for five or six days already. Which I really don't mind because I like big messy hair, but the say I just did my hair last night, it should not look like this. Because if it's looking like this already, I'm going to have to do my hair like another day, in another day or so. So, I'm going to do a quick turnaround. So, the lighting is kind of sucky. Let's see if you can see with the outside light, which I doubt. So, one more time. Trying to bring some sunlight in here, but it's not happening. Um, so that's it right now. I really can't give it a thumbs up, thumbs down. I'm gonna do it again and give it a fair review. Um, just wanted to show you guys what's going on with my first trial and error, as you can say. I won't call it a 100% fail, but um, I can say like my hair is soft, it's shiny in some places, and you know you can see the coils like you know they're trying to pop through, they're trying to show up. But that's it, guys. Um, today is what January twentieth. Still no meat. Um, one thing I do see, I'm gonna have to incorporate more water. Um, the scale is moving down, so I'm happy about that. Um, I'm getting into the gym more, so everything is going pretty good. So I wanted to make this video very short and simple, and show you guys the dark and lovely. So I will be giving this another try, so stay tuned. And um, if you have any questions, comments, comments, please leave them below, inbox me, whatever. Don't forget to subscribe, give it a thumbs up, all that good stuff. So stay true, and always be you, and this is me. I'm signing off. Oh, yeah. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, my name is Love Is Me. L U V I Z M E E. Come follow me. All right, guys. See you later. Bye.